making us dumb. They're trying to keep us in the dark, in the dark of their polluted clouds and their toxins and the dirty air. But we have a dream for uh, children in Richmond. We have a dream that you can upgrade your old hundred year inefficient, um, inefficient um, equipment. equipment. If you can make billions of dollars in one year, you can spend a few million dollars cleaning up your crap. Yeah. Our dream for the children in Richmond is that we have healthy, clean environment, clean energy, human energy, not this nasty, dirty crew that's polluting the air and the lungs of our people. Chevron, get out of Richmond! Woo! Introduce one of our community members, Mong Sang. Um, hi, my name is Wong Sang. I lived in um, Richmond. I came from Laos and live in Richmond for over 20 plus years. And Chevron has been there since I've been there and longer. And I know, you know, people need to make a living. They need to make money, but not at the um, cost of people, not at the cost of um, the yes. Richmond residents. And I'm here today to say that, yeah, go ahead and make your money, but do it in a good way, a clean way. We need clean energy, not dirty energy. So we don't have money to pay for our health care. We don't have money. We can't make money. We're poor people, low income people, and they are there to make money at the cost of our health, and that is not okay. They need to stop today. Okay. Um, I can go. I'm Sandy Saturn. Um, I, I came from Laos. My family came over um, when I was three months and we landed in Richmond, California. I lived there for over 27 years. And um, growing up, like Andre said, we thought Chevron was cool, right? I went to Perry's Elementary, which is right across the street from the Chevron Refinery. And instead of practicing, you know, fire drills and earthquake drills, we were practicing in case there's a Chevron spill, in case General Chemical, you know, explodes, what do we do? We jump on buses and drive around the community until supposedly it was safe to go back to school. And I used to think it was cool because Chevron had this special program at Perry's Elementary where they took a certain amount of kids to their refinery every week to swim in their pool to play basketball you know Chevron was the coolest thing they had erasers and pencils um, that they were giving out to students and you know so that they can buy the community and say that you know they're good for the community which they're not and it wasn't until I joined APEN's youth program that I found out what they were doing to me to my health and to my community and just covering up with a couple cents you know a couple dollars here and there and you know, I'm here today to say no, no more Chevron. Chevron out of Richmond. Woo! Thank you. Vivian's gonna lead some chants. Popular, popularized by Richmond Progressive Alliance. 
close up. Uh, this is a chant that was popularized by RPA, Richmond Progressive Alliance. But it goes, Chevron, Chevron, you can't hide. We can see your greedy side. Chevron, Chevron, you can't hide. We can see your greedy side. Organizing project, a project of APEN. Thank you guys for coming out and bringing your folks.